I'm Philip Belcher from Bellman's, and I'd like to talk about English table clocks today with thecellroom.com. Following the invention of an accurate clock in the mid-17th century with a pendulum, they very quickly established a large trade in London in clockmaking. The cases were relatively plain, but there was some adornment, such as the finials here, little filigree panels and a handle. In contrast to the plainness of the case, the movements were quite highly decorated. And as you can see here, you had a silver chapter ring, which told you the hours, beautiful cherub masks and an engraved and matted centre. The back plates were always beautifully engraved with foliage and scrolls. They were designed to be portable and at night if you wanted to tell the time you could take it to your bedchamber and there was a small little lever at the side which would tell you the time. So what we heard there was quarter to seven, six single strikes and three double strikes. So moving on, here we have a clock that's a little bit later, it's probably around about 1715, 1720, and you'll notice it's in this beautiful walnut case, very rich, pleasing colour, a little bit more ornament as well, and you can see here you have these beautiful pierced panels of brass which are also engraved. Part of the uh, reasoning for this was not only to show off the great skill of the craftsman, but it also allowed the sound to come out of the strike and also the quarter repeat. And here on the dial, strike silent, so if you wished at night you can turn it off. And below the maker's name, just here is the calendar, so another sort of area of functionality. And here you'll notice the dial is arched, which is a later progression of styles. The earlier ones were square. English table clocks such as these are a feature of many good auctions. Something like this I'd expect to make somewhere in the region of six to nine thousand pounds. This one, interestingly enough, the case is a later replica which does affect its value. Today this is something I'd expect to make somewhere in the region of fifteen hundred to two and a half thousand pounds. Had it had its original case it would probably make somewhere around ten to fifteen thousand.